guys, welcome to another edition of View from the Zoo. Um, so I believe someone requested that we do a uh, behind the scenes in our hippo house. So welcome to the hippo house. Uh, I'm going to tell you a little bit about what we do here and what we do with the hippos. Um, so very shortly we're going to be bringing these guys in for their PM feed. Uh, we tend to feed them sort of uh, once a day with a little bit of a snack in the afternoon. Um, so here you can see that we've got their uh, PM feed ready for them to come into. Uh, so they get two big piles of hay, one each. Um, on top of the hay we've got uh, their pellet feed, so you can see there it's uh, basically cattle feed. Their, um, their digestion, their nutritional needs are very similar to that of cattle, so we buy in some cattle feed for them. Um, and we put a little bit of linseed pellet on there too, which is uh, very good for their skin and their nails. Um, so we tend to feed these, as I said, once a day. That tends to be in the evening because it kind of replicates uh, a little bit closer to what they would be doing in the wild, which would be coming out of the water sources of the evening and uh, grazing throughout the night. So we try to uh, replicate that in captivity as well. Um, so very soon we'll be bringing these guys in and uh, you'll get to meet them themselves. two lovely hippos. Um, so we've got Ernie at the front here, um, who is our male, and Godzilla is over at the back. Hopefully she'll come over and say hello as well. Um, so Godzilla here, the female, she arrived here um, back in around 2002 from West Midland Safari Park. Um, she arrived with her sister Betty, and um, Shortly after their arrival, uh, Betty gave birth to Ernie. So uh, these two are auntie and nephews. So they're a non-breeding pair. Um, so these guys, uh, we do a little bit of training with them. Um, so we tend to ask them to open up so we can check their teeth. Uh, so the command for that is just to open our arms up, say open, and chuck a reward in there once we've had a good look. So the reason we do that is basically just to get a good look at their teeth, tongue and lips and make sure that there's no problems in there. So that's a little bit of basic training that we do with these guys. Um, so very soon we'll uh, let them in for their tea and they can have uh, their proper full allowance, not just these little snacks that I'm throwing in here. Sub-Saharan Africa. Um, they are semi-aquatic mammals. Um, so they have very soft skin, very delicate skin. Uh, they spend an awful lot of time in the water, really only coming out of the water during an evening uh, to graze and get in all of the, the daily calorific needs. Um, so in fact, their uh, the scientific name means water horse. So that kind of gives you an idea of how much time they do spend out in the water. Um, so here in, in uh, Flamingoland, they have a lovely big lake outside that they spend an awful lot of time in. So um, hopefully, on your next visit to Flamingoland, come and have a look at their lake and you'll see these guys um, out there in the water enjoying themselves. Um, so our two hippos here, I absolutely love working with these guys. Um, they have big personalities. Uh, so Godzilla, the uh, one that is closest to us, she tends to be the greediest hippo. Um, and Ernie over there, he's uh, probably one of the laziest of those as well. He's uh, very tricky to get out of bed on the morning. Uh, he's usually the tempted though with a little bit of snack uh, to get out of bed.
So I know a lot of you guys um, may have books in counters as a birthday treat or a special occasion treat and are no longer able to join us with that. Um, so if you guys have any birthdays or special occasions coming up and you have a favourite animal, um, feel free to write in the comments um, your, what date it would be and uh, what animals you would like to see and we'll see if we can do a special filmed encounter for you guys so you can still come and join us even though you can't physically be here. So I hope you enjoyed meeting our hippos, thank you very much for uh, joining us and I uh, hope to see you again soon.